is actually true and this is the case, then the clout level of the Clemson Sports Car Club is just being doubled. Except it's never going to be here. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, Where is it gonna it's be? gonna sit in the funeral in home uh, at uh, Harris's grandparents. Why? He's gonna drive it around for a thirty day time. So all the hoses can go bad. Is he it? He already all broke? <laughs> no. We're back from the dyno watching. Uh, what is this? Minutes. Motor trend. Motor, motor trend, trend on live. demand. Live. Motor trend live. It's a C motor. This would focus. This is a sh what else is cool, shit channel. <laughs> focus. There you go. The the way the bottom of that trans pan is designed. What See how it, it? it covers half the flex plate and comes up to the block. Yeah. It's only the top half of that's open. So, hey, we're four L sixty just sleep bell housing. Not really, but what is it? We're filming a roadkill episode today. What is what is it? <laughs> my ass is gonna be sitting here. Oh fuck, I left my key at home. Never mind. <laughs> <laughs> How oh, inconvenient, gonna... you live a quarter mile I mean, you could move this, and then you could bring the Tercel up here, and then we yeah, can we have both channels. Yeah, we just drive up here. Yeah, we well, said you were gonna get us started, so. got a ratchet strap. It coughed a little bit. I poured some gas in the car, and it was like laughing. Too bad Harris is near. Yeah. He, he could push it with how big <laughs> yeah. he's gotten. Yo, man, you, you kind of like shitty vehicles. <laughs> Do you, yeah. <laughs> do, do, you, do you want to buy a jet ski? You can have it for 360. I still have what you bought that thing for. I, yeah, okay, I'll be honest. I have $200 in it. So let me make a little money, dude. I don't want a jet ski, though. But, like, if I did, I would. Kate wants a jet ski. Do you know, know anyone? If Kate knew about the jet ski, would she make you buy it? If Kate knew about the jet ski, no. Yeah, no, I, don't, I don't think she, she'd be on board. She's already pissed <laughs> enough about like the amount of dumb shit I buy for my cars as it is. Like if I came home with a jet ski, just what like... What if you told her it was for her? <clears throat> oh, okay. we told her it was for her. Yeah, hey, you know, Kate, I bought you a shitbox jet ski yeah, just gonna park it in your to car. match my shitbox cars. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, the Cadillac could be a tow rig for her. The HOA won't let me keep it anymore. Really? Yeah. Well, no, they will, but they're charging me more than it's worth, so. What are they charging? Well, they, ch they charge $50 a month oh to keep God. it there, and they said they'll tow it otherwise. So. Have y'all started getting actually charged for, sh for like, Justin's no. boat and shit? No, but it's going to happen. Justin's boat's right here. Well, yeah. when it was there, yeah, I mean, no, here. no, we've gotten away with it so far, but they're starting to crack down, so. You think next summer when Justin puts it back, <clears> for sure. Sure. Josh, you want to go uh, show the vlog you your your hate? new purchase? Bump the ball. Yeah, sure. You, All right. you have the hands I, Jeez, I don't and know. What about this thing? Walking the over there. You bump the wall and you fail. Hey guys. Time hey. Yeah. Sometimes wow, I don't want to drop this. All right, so uh, I got a, a new car, um, and it's not this new car. Um, so I got a Tercel, and it was like actually zero dollars. Uh, <clears throat> And this is the only reason I got it, because it's four-wheel drive, it's a stick shift. Um, the interior is like absolutely fucking destroyed, it's disgusting and it smells like dog shit in here, so I just try to not go in there. Alright boys, welcome to Jackass, we're gonna try to uh, get a Tercel running. Uh, I couldn't find it. Alright kids. Right, boys. So this finds out the lift pump is functioning and if the carburetor is functioning. What's a lift pump? Like lift pump is right there. It's a fuel pump that's usually mounted on the motor. It's uh -oh. usually gear driven or something. So. I got it. Why do you? What are both lines here? I don't know. I think one's like a... One's a return, I would I imagine. only hooked one up before and it didn't work, so I hooked up both and I figured... One didn't work. Make it two! Because these are both... These are where they're both coming in? Yeah. I, I would guarantee one's a return. Well, yeah. Oh, dude, you know what? What? What's that? Is this a lift pump or is this just a fuel pressure rig? No, it's the fuel pump. Because there's a... It goes to the cam. It, oh, and it's on a cam load? Yeah. I see. I probably gotta clean the bowl. It's really what it is. Because even the fuck fuel can get that? to right know. here, and then they. Sure you don't? I, don't I thought know. you worked on anything. Dude, I bet you. I would guarantee. I guarantee you, if we take this carb off, the um, the float bowl is fucked up. And you also have a vacuum I'm missing. That might be. We have a uh, special occurrence happening in today's video. Alfie's working on his vehicle. Alfie's touching his engine. 
Alfie fixing the M3, what? How do you feel about fixing the M3, Alfie? So I'm not fixing it all the way because I still want a vacuum under here. Do we have a vacuum here? We do, but am I going to bring the vacuum all the way here with extension cord? Oh my, the laziness. Look at this carb. Set up, kids. Look at all these fucking vacuum lines that will never get put that back is, out of the same place. That is more vacuum lines than a rotary. <laughs> you know, Josh, just sawzall would fix this problem. Sawzall? What's that? Sawzall. Yeah, it never turned on the first time, but it didn't work. No, the carburetor. Oh. Yeah, that's right. Crank it. I don't know. That didn't go back. I don't know if that's. No, it's because the throttling just undone. Oh, okay. I was like, motherfucker, what did I just do? You turned your carb off and on. Yeah, start it up now, dude. Yeah, dude. Dude, there's like this plate underneath, and that just pretty much means that like it's not gonna come up. Wow. That's. That's yeah. All, that's all going in there. <laughs> Too well over here. If it was EFI, it would be simpler. Well, yeah. Oh, thanks. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> thank you for that informative. Ah! <laughs> That's the grossest thing. It was like orange juice. Josh, did you notice that? What? The your intake, intake manifold, manifold is your exhaust babies. manifold. That's really That's, common. Jeeps yeah, do it too. Jeeps really? are like that. Yeah, the four liter. Josh, you, he's on AM. They didn't know anything about it. What? Are you going to use the hose? Yeah. No, I don't know. I used it. I just, get a video. You I, it just leaks over the there, so I washed my hand off with it. Off now? It's off now? I lost a screw in here. No, it's right here. <laughs> little, 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 little small right? screw. Yeah, that was for the space. <laughs> James, this is the type of content your vlog needs. <laughs> My vlog needs a lot of content. It needs more Alfred doing. You're gonna get pissed because that shirt's gonna get dirty. Yeah. Take it off. Exactly. Do it for the vlog. Yeah. You didn't even put the wing on, you just bought the bolts. It's not even I bought the yeah. bolts. <laughs> oh, I don't think I don't think we showed you vlog. Alfie's got a wing now. I think we showed him in one of the vlogs. I don't know. Well, I remember I was gonna try to film a vlog, but then I didn't. So I remember you walking out, we were playing I was playing Poison one day and you walked out here saying I'm gonna film Alfie's car with a wing on it. Oh. I don't know if you ever put it in a video. Though. I don't know if I, I doubt it. I don't think I put it in a video. Alfie, you keep up with my videos. No, I never saw it. Alright. Not in there. Now it is, boys. I see the problem. Dude, do you see the gas that came out of this? It's, oh my God. Uh, like, it's, it's not look a Look at all the tarnish. See how it hasn't evaporated? Dude, that it just got all over me. All the... <laughs> this is so gross. Um, the first step would be looking in here. There's going to be a diaphragm in there. We probably have a pin behind it. Pop this open. And then it looks like the entire... God, I the entire top it. comes yeah. off. What are we... We're trying to open the whole thing right like yeah because right here somewhere yeah. in here there's going to be a pin that blocks fuel flow from this inlet yeah from flooding it so and that's most likely well this is where it, yeah, and this is the most complicated carburetor i've ever seen in my life we're in the first steps of ripping this bad boy apart to see why like, it uh came all over josh this is like like if you're losing you your virginity words like the that time you do it, you why just, not like, you get gangbanged instead of like <laughs> this is dude you can just you can feel how this one's gummed up look at yeah. All right, Graham, you want to fill us in on what happened? Right now, this is the, no, we're not getting tight on it. This is where the, the seat for the the float valve goes. And so we gotta remove it so we can make sure we clean it so that float, the float needle valve is, uh, Alright. What did we, uh, what did we find in here? A lot of tarnish, a lot of what we expected. No, it moved. Didn't oh it? shit, did it? Yeah, it did. Okay. Do you need a gasket for this bad boy? Yeah, I think so. There's one on there already which we're gonna reuse, so. <laughs> yeah, I'm not, I'm oh my god, dude. If you've ever seen what it looks like to get hepatitis, that's <laughs> it. <laughs> Oh, it's sick, dude. Razor blade. It's still good. We'll, Free razor blade. We'll put some WD-40 on Let me, let me on see it. that. Cool, thanks, bud. <laughs> see, what if I cut myself did. and died? <laughs> Keto tube is actually zero meters per second. It's just the pressure difference. Did you know the LS is the That's, best motor in the world? And the second best is the FA-20. <laughs> actually, no, it's a 3A. 
How can you bring your ship? So, I uh, I believe that you missed that out on this, but if you look very closely, you see I actually used a high quality gasket. Uh, it's a blue moon uh, it's cardboard box side. There it is. Yep. I forgot. All right. So you guys rebuilt it. this try it, and then let's see. by going around a foil wire. Sure. To measure Dude, try the gas jug first, man. Oh, that's what it looks. Okay. It's James and Joel. Ah! It's leaking. Go with the first line. It's instantly gonna go. Prepped it for fire, so keep the camera on. <laughs> yeah. <thank you. laughs> I'm prepping it for a couple James, of I want you to be successful. I'm trying to give you content. <laughs> hide over here behind the hood. Yeah, hold that gas jug, but hide behind <laughs> the <them>. gas jug. <laughs> be ready to just fucking zoot out of there with that thing. Should I grab Got the it. fire extinguisher? Maybe. Josh, <laughs> Josh, I think your battery's gonna fucking die. Wait, is it on? The radio's been on and <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> God. Oh, yeah, I forgot the sketch. Whatever. Whatever. Sorry. It's fine. I mean, it's never. We'll really... jump it with this. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, I, I jumped this thing with that a bunch of times, so. Doing right, so the favor, we're... dude. All right, video take this. Cause it's gonna be like... All right, this is catching all fire, kids. <laughs> I'm just gonna put it on Craigslist if it doesn't <laughs> roll it that way. If it doesn't start, I don't. It's not in my name. <clears throat> and just go for it. I don't even see fuel coming out. Yeah, that, that'll help the process. We need like some, get a hole. put some like... Oh! What is, what is wrong with you? It says it's flammable. Yeah, but that's not... Do we need to hook this up? Like the battery? Flammable and combustible are two different things. This one... I don't know. I think I'm... Craigslist. Give up on it. Anybody want to buy a four-wheel drive Tercel? It'll be, uh... Mint running condition. It'll be $200 delivered to Grand Millie. Grand Wind Park. What's up guys? I got some new photography stuff, so kind of pumped about that. We have a tripod now, so it'll be a lot less of me just standing here holding camera and talking. It'll be on this, and then I can use my hands and stuff. Also picked up a little windsock for the mic. Kind of makes seeing the screen a pain in the ass, but hopefully it works. Give me a second, I'll put you all on the tripod. All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed our post-dino day shenanigans. Uh, Josh is really trying to get that four-wheel drive Tercel running. We definitely had some car problems. We tried to clean it as best we could. Graham suggests we ship it off to someone from eBay because there's like carb cleaning services on eBay for like 50 bucks. There is, I will do a little bit of a car reveal later in the week from one of our friends that uh, picked up something really cool that Josh was mentioning in the beginning of this video. If you have not already, head over to the 2x4co Instagram page and their website. I'm going to do another giveaway probably for a poster or some shirts this time. So stay tuned to their Instagram, the website, and my Instagram, which is at jamesfcwood. If you do not follow me on there, you definitely should. I post way more stuff on Instagram than YouTube. It's just a lot easier to do that, and it helps you guys keep up to date with me and everybody and what's going on when YouTube videos are scarce. Please do that. Remember to go check out all of the 2x4 Co. merch. Actually, shit, I need to show you guys that. Hold on. This is actually the James Wood Racing Tune FC shirt. So let me show you guys the back. Hopefully you all like it. So it's got just the Tune sticker design with FC3S on the back. I like correlated shirts, but I don't like a lot of Carly shirts with a bunch of crap in the front, which I used to have a lot of. Turned out they looked terrible, so I threw a lot of them away. So I'm starting to do basically basic shirts like this with something on your chest and then just have a design on the back, and that's what I'm gonna start with, like really pushing out. Head over to the website right now to pick up your James Wood Racing FC Tune shirt. They are only $20. I'd love to see you guys rocking these things. They're really comfortable. The quality's great, they're soft. 
I personally love this shirt. The printing came out amazing. They got all the details that we had on the sticker on the shirt. So print shop did a great job. Head over there, get yours today, and send me pictures of y'all rocking them. I want to see them, and we will catch y'all later. Bye, y'all. Also, let me know what you guys think of Josh's uh, rare four-wheel drive Tercel. That thing is going to be a fun little project for him to do. Uh, I want to see what happens to it. But also, if you guys want to buy it, you can you can pick it up right now. Just let any one of us know. So we will catch you guys later. Thank you for watching. Remember to get your uh, get your James Wood racing shirts, and we will see you next time. Bye, y'all.